Hi, this is Jason Penrose at the Penrose team at eXp Realty. Thank you for tuning in to Jason Penrose TV. We're going to be recapping here the third quarter of 2024. There are some definite changes. Stay tuned. Thanks again for tuning in to Jason Penrose TV. So what we're talking about today is the end of September and the beginning of October of 2024. There's 22,403 homes on the market now versus 15,562 last year. That's a 43% increase in the available inventory. Homes under contract, 6,970 now versus 6,616 last year. That's a 5.3% increase in homes under contract. Homes sold, 5,699 this year versus 5,481 last year. That's a 3.9% increase in homes sold. Month supply of inventory went up from 2.4 months last year to 3.4 months this year, a 41.6% increase. So what does that mean? More inventory. However, we still have less than a six month supply of homes. So there's still a shortage of homes, but we have more homes now than we did this time last year. We also have more homes under contract and more homes closing. So more transactions are happening, which means more buyers are coming into the market. We know that recently the Fed cut the Fed, federal funds rate by 0.5% or two basis or 50 basis points. And what that means is, you know, the, the federal funds rate dropped and people think that means mortgage rates dropped. Well, mortgage rates dropped before that. So the public is now starting to become aware that rates aren't as high as they were a couple of months ago. The buyers are coming back into the market and things are picking up again. If you know anybody thinking about buying or selling a home, please share this video and you can reach out to me anytime, 602-738-9943. I look forward to hearing from you soon. Make it a great day.